finding equations to trig graphs. This is a cosine omega times x. So we're trying we're supposed to find this the equation of this graph. It's a cosine this is omega times x. And we're supposed to keep in mind that a the amplitude is equal to the absolute value of x. So the amp so we know this is a cosine curve uh, given what we know so far because it starts up here and we can talk about phase shift and we can make that whole argument but for now we're going to stay with this so I'm going to take this as a cosine curve its amplitude is 2 so that gives us this much of it so far that equals cosine omega times x and then this is the period here this sets the period for us and we know that the period is equal to 2 pi over absolute omega. So given that, if we just look and we can see the period here is this, and this is how we do this. One complete cycle would be this one right here, just so you can get a look at it. One complete cycle, let's just let it start here, goes up, comes down, goes up, right? So here it starts to go down, starts to go down again, so this is one cycle of that curve, and it goes from zero to four pi. So what we have is this. We have that our period is 4 pi, and 4 pi equals 2 pi over absolute omega. From here, all I'm going to do is just a little bit of cross multiplication. Here, so I'm going to multiply this way and that, and we're going to get 2 pi is equal to 4 pi omega. Omega looks a little bit like a W, right? I'm going to divide both sides by 4 pi. So dividing both sides by 4 pi, the pi is canceled, 2 over 4 is 1 half, so omega is equal to 1 half. So we go back here and we put in 1 half x. So the equation for this graph is 2 cosine 1 half x equals our f of x curve. All right, I'm going to do one more video and I'm going to do it on sine curves. So hopefully this was helpful for you. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe and your comments are always welcome. Thanks.